All right, folks, how goes it? Um, this is, I haven't done anything new in a while, and um, basically I've uh, been uh, ordering stuff off of the Wish app. Um, if you're not familiar with Wish, they're f advertising everywhere. Um, not necessarily in traditional channels like on TV, um, but if you watch the McGregor fight, they were prevalent there. If you've watched UFC, they've got ads there. Um, if you watch the NBA, they have their logo on the Celtics jerseys. And um, I guess in my research on Wish, Wish is kind of what a lot of people are calling um, a challenger to Amazon. And it's... I wouldn't go that far. Um, what I would say is it's kind of a cross between um, uh, whatever that Japanese company, Alibaba or whatever it is, and um, a little bit of Amazon as well. Um, pretty much 90% of the products are coming from China or other countries, um, and there are some U.S.-based sellers as well. Um, but one of the real key selling points of Wish is rock-bottom, dirt-cheap pricing. Um, and I picked up a couple items. One of the first items I got um, was the was just a uh, simple uh, four-port, yep, four-port. USB uh, scanner. Um, I think I paid like maybe or USB uh, adapter. Um, I got that fairly, fairly cheap. Um, I want to say it was like maybe a dollar or two. Um, I haven't tried it out yet to see how it works. Um, some of the issues I've heard about Wish is don't use it for um, clothing. Don't use it for um, makeup. If you're a lady, but I'm obviously a guy, not really using it for makeup. Um, some of the clothing has sparked my interest. Um, some of the t-shirts I'm familiar with that I've seen from other sites, uh, Spring Tea seems to have a pretty decent presence on there. And um, they are shipping for the U.S. And um, their sizing is usually pretty good. So um, some things have caught my eye, some things I haven't caught my eye. So I just got in today another order item I ordered. Um, it's a wallet. And... One of the interesting things about Wish is they give you a really wide range on delivery times. And, for example, I don't know if you can see it really well here on the Wish app. Um, this was supposed to come de by December 1st. I ordered it on the 26th of October, so I think last Monday it would have been. Um, 26th of October 2017 um, and it arrived here today which is uh, November 7th so it actually came 25 days early which is not bad um, I think the reason why they give these wide ranges of um, deliveries is because if it gets cut up in customs or something weird happens um, they're covered um, one thing I have been doing is they give you the option to pay with PayPal, which I've done all the purchases with PayPal. I think I'm up to four or five items I've, I've bought, and I don't think I've spent more than like 10, 15 bucks. Um, so, worth a shot taking a look at it. Um, so, not bad. Um, this is the wallet. Let's see what it looks like. Let's see if it's good quality. Um, Mostly just kind of replacing my, my other wallet. It's getting a little worn out. Plastic and plastic. Um, it's kind of cool. I've noticed in a couple of the items. It kind of has like that Amazon tracking sticker inside the warehouse. So, um, not too, too bad. Um, reasonable plastic packaging on the outside of it. If I can get it open. Ah, there we go. There we go. Now, I'm knowing this is a le this is leather. And this is probably that lower grain leather. Um, the stuff that's kind of the leftover scraps from leather jackets and such. Um, so it's not going to be the greatest quality. Uh, but if I can get a couple months out of it, or... You know, I would be very happy with it. Um, so kind of a nice matted finish. Actually feels pretty good. A uh, couple of 
more from the tracking from the plastic. On the inside, two slots for different types of, if you separate your money. Oh, Scylla gel, Scylla, Scylla gel. That is the mark of quality, gotta keep it fresh. Uh, two spots for a couple cards right there. Um, spot for your ID. Lot less sl slots than I thought it was going to have. Um, my current wallet is loaded. So, see how well it works. See how the cards fit. Let's, uh, let's throw my Costco ID in and see where that fits. See how things work. Not too, too bad. Fits pretty nicely in the center thing. I'm probably going to wind up having to double up cards, but that's okay. Uh, no real lips underneath like my other wallet, but see what I can do with this, see how it looks. Um, I'll put, uh, actually really can't put a link in the description, um, but Wish App, um, this is the Ferdini wallet. I'll give it a shot, I'll see how it goes. Um, Again, I think I got it either free or for like two dollars with shipping. So again, not a huge loss for something that's you know decent leather, maybe a little pleather, yeah, more of a vinyl quality. As I'm kind of taking a second look at it, eh, vinyl and leather a little bit. So not too too bad. You can kind of see on the inside there, it's true leather. Um, like, share, and subscribe. And uh, thank you very much. And have a good day.